You got some money? Let's see. Come here, how much? Let's see how much money you got. Come over here. Can I buy some? What you gonna buy? Mm -hmm. You don't know? What are you doing? Well, you don't have to take it all out. I just wanna see. Okay, two. Four. How many dollars? Four. Bye, y'all. Bye, bye. Tell them high five. High five. Mm. Man, you balling. Okay, I'm about to make a video, so can I be excused for a second? Wait, but you help me. Yeah, what am I doing? That one, that one. Oh. I go buy the old one. You go buy your own stuff? Yeah, go on, go. One, two, three, four. You got four dollars. Bye, y'all. Baller. I want, I want, like you money, you boy. You don't have to ask me for no more money? Not that I will make some money. Oh, you have to make some money. Not that I will make, make take money. I want, I want, I want the money. I want, I want, I can pay all by myself. My mom pay by me. With oh, okay. So you can pay all by yourself. You don't need mama to pay for you. No. All right, baby. Hi guys, and welcome back. <laughs> As soon as I cut the camera on to start recording, Mason walked up to tell me all about the money that he had. We'll get ready to go to the DT. Y'all know what that stands for, the DT. It goes down. Anyways, guys, welcome back to another weekly plan video. Um, I want to do this video a little bit different just to kind of jazz some things up here and do a little bit of a chit-chat. I've been really chatty this week, period, but a little bit of chit-chat. And I kind of just wanted to talk to you guys just actually not even talk just to say this y'all it's just like mind-boggling how fast time seems to be going by i mean before you know it santa claus shall be knocking at the door he won't be coming down no chimneys here because we don't have one he will be knocking at the door but man it's just i don't it's crazy this season in life for me it's just Busy and I, I don't know for the last year and a half. I've been saying that and I kind of feel like it just snuck up on me If you will like I had no warning like there was no text no email no 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 nothing to say by the way All of these to do's are about to get popped into your lap figure it out kind of thing. You know what I'm saying? So Anyways, I kind of feel like some days I need a nanny for each child including the dog Yes, I thought they were making my video, then we go go. Can you not talk with food in your mouth? Thank you, baby. That's just like today. Um, I would love to give you guys content that was free of bloopers and kids and ish. But you know what? I have to realize that this is my life and the season of life I'm in. I don't take a bath by myself. I don't go to the bathroom alone. Let alone get to record a video by myself. So there it is. Take me with all my other people as it is. What are you doing? No, and every two minutes they come and ask for stuff. Why do these kids think they need to eat every three minutes? I don't get it. Can you like bounce chicken one one? We're about to get ready to go. Give me like two minutes. Go take care of this because something's going on there. I'm not, I'm not working with that. Bye. Go take care of your hair. Go brush it. Peace. And what were you eating? I'm like, yeah. ooh, 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 that just stinks. <laughs> Anyways, guys, back to the topic at hand. This season in life just seems to be really, really busy. So I'm going to purposely this week and moving forward, do my very best to find those pocket of windows to have silent time. Be alone in my thoughts, which is probably not a good thing, but whatever. Um, be alone with the Lord and in his word. And having those pocket of times that I spend with each one of my kids individually, including Lola the Pug. That's easier said than done on most days, of course, because especially when you got four. Four your ears are like filthy. Four kids, you are spread so thin all day, every day. If you got kids out there, raise your hand, you know what I mean, right? Okay, guys. That was my two minute or however many minutes, minutes it's been we've been going like this. Mason, can you stop? You see what I'm saying? It's just, this is what it is. It's real life. This is how we roll around here. All right, Mason, let's tell our friends what we're having for dinner this night. Nacho. Nachos? Baby, nachos are not on my menu. No. Then what do you want to have? We're going to have a pork loin. Okay, so today pork is... Pork loin. Pork loin. Not pork. Be quiet. Okay, guys, so this week's menu, no, I'm going to read it off to you instead of showing it to you like no, I normally do. Okay, how are you doing? Sunday eggs and grits for um, breakfast. 
Lunch on Sunday? I don't know. They can fend for themselves, huh? Uh, breakfast, yes. We eat some trivia breakfast. You ate some trivia for breakfast? No. No? Can I, can I finish? Um, dinner is a pork tenderloin. Bam. Two said. Talk about mama know how to put a foot up in some stuff. It's going to be good. All right, moving on. Um, of course, Monday, we're going to have leftovers, so pork to the loin on Monday as well. Tuesday, I'm going to do a piece of bake recipe that I found on another channel. Um, Organized Mom, I believe it's a channel. I'll link it below, but she got the recipe, I think, from Pinterest, and it looked it yummy and quick and easy, so I'll be giving that recipe a try, and I'll be sure to link it for you. Wednesday, of course, is Bible Sunday night for the kids. Husband's at school, so we're going to be having sandwiches. What kind, I don't know. It'd probably be P&J for Jada, ham and cheese for everybody else. No, I don't, don't know yet. Um, and then Thursday, we'll have leftovers from the piece of bake. Um, and then Friday, we'll be having fajitas. That's yeah. the plan. And then Saturday, it'll yeah. be leftovers from fajitas on Saturday's dinner. And then no more. No more dinner. No more dinner? Then no more dinner, makes it says. <laughs> Saturday, we're going to have cereal, of course, Saturday morning. Um, and for lunch, of course, it's always kid choice. Mason started football this Saturday. He will have a game next Saturday. What time? I don't know. What's going to get done Saturday? I don't know. Do you know? Yeah. No. So we'll probably be eating whatever they have available at the field on Saturday, if not going they through somebody. Got the food. They got food at the field? Yes, the field down is that one thing. That's a little people. That's how you bring some. The, the, the little people bring something. The snack, yeah. Some yeah. snack. Oh, okay, he's saying that people bring snacks to the field, so I guess we're gonna be eating snacks for lunch. So not lunch. Not lunch, just snack. Yeah. Okay, just snack. That's a pretty snack. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Saturday. I don't know. Uh, but okay, guys. So I will. Uh, I will quickly flip the camera around. Yeah, yeah, that's not here. I will quickly flip the camera around and show you guys the boss, aka the planner. I'm gonna go quickly through it, um, and I only want to show it to you guys because I think it came out cute. I did another spread where I used to. Let me just show you. It came out nice, and then we'll get into the grocery haul. Okay, haul guys, that. just a glimpse of the boss and how she came out. I used another printable kit from the Daisy.com or CuteDaisy.com um, website, and I did the owl kit. I think it came out really, 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 really cute. I love the colors. Very muted from what it was last week. Um, my dedication spread to Deshaun was a little bit more on the wild side. But this is more muted, so I do like that. And I love the little owls there. If you guys can make that out and see it. But that's pretty much it. I won't go into great detail on the to-dos because, again, life is just too hectic and busy. And these kids are waiting on me to get to the Dollar Tree. So I got to get going. Um, I didn't put in a song of the week yet because I'm still meditating on what exactly I want to, um, to be listening to all week. So... I will share with you guys a quote that I took from this, um, this Sunday sermon at church. And it just says, the truth is life cannot be managed. It can only be lived. Pastor was preaching um, based off of Psalm 37, 39. And then something else he said towards the end was, when I am lost, I once again turn my hope towards God. And purpose re resets, courage returns. Hope renews in my life. And I just thought that was beautiful. It spoke to a lot of things that's going on with myself, personal-wise, so on and so forth. Okay, guys, let's get into the grocery haul and wrap this video up. All right, guys, so this week's grocery haul, I need to stock up on some fresh fruit. So we got a bag of the cuties. I got another sack of the small apples. Of course, bananas is always on the list. We'll split this between the house and the daycare. And then I went ahead and picked up some pineapples for myself. I love a few little fresh pineapples in the morning. Now, I need to really stop being lazy and start buying an actual whole pineapple and then just chop it up. But I ain't got time for that life. Moving on. I think of strawberries. You guys know we are a strawberry eating family around here between my kids and the daycare kiddos. Then I picked up another pack of these sliced apple slices. My daycare kiddos love those as well as my kids. So that's all on fruit that'll last us for a little minute there. 
Then I also picked up myself two small cucumbers. Love those. I went ahead this week and I got a smaller bag of um, the Gordon salad. I usually buy the family pack and this week we have just been so busy. Dinners have been just, we've been sticking to the meal plan, but the hubby has not been fixing the exact meal every night, if you will. So he's been leaving salad off the plate pretty much every night. So we wasted a lot of salad this week, which really upsets my nerve. But anywho, I decided I'll go ahead and start doing these smaller packs. So... During the weeks that we are busy with heavy activities in the evening um, and the hubby is fixing dinner and he forgets, right, he forgets to put salad on the plate, I don't have to worry about it being wasted because we have such a small pack. So, anyways, got a small pack this time around. I also ended up picking up an onion. I needed to get an onion to go with my pork loin that I'm going to be fixing on Sunday, so I got a sweet yellow onion. Um, of course, a gallon of 2% milk, always for the family. And I went ahead and got a one, um, a half a gallon of the 1% milk for the daycare this time. I mentioned to you guys a couple, I don't know, maybe two weeks back, that we had a half a gallon for the daycare left over, and I couldn't figure out why. And then when I dawned on me, half of the kids I have right now are infants, so they're not even on cow's milk, so no wonder I had so much milk left over. So I don't like wasting food at all, so I went ahead and got a half a gallon instead this time. Flour tortillas, we were completely out and needed more. I uh, think of simple orange juice. Me and Jalen are the only ones that really drink this. Hopefully it lasts for the whole week because that boy drinks orange juice like it's water. Oh, he be irking my nerves with that one. But so I got that. Right, moving on to a few other things that I needed to get. Um, we were completely out of vinegar. Um, I use vinegar all the time, pretty much for everything, cooking, cleaning, health benefits. Um, I'm a vinegar all the way type of girl. So I got two more things of vinegar. Now I had coupons for um these bush Latina beans. So I got the regular refried beans. This is a new, um, well, it says a new twist on refried beans. Um, and it has smashed pinto beans, tomatoes, peppers, um, and a touch of bacon in here. So I thought that was good to have on hand. I got two of each, and I also picked up um, a thing of the black bean um, refried beans as well. Now, the coupon was for a dollar off of two. They were priced at $0.85. Cent, so it made each can $0.35 cent each. So I got six cans total. Um, we do have taco night at least two to three times um, all of a month, so that's definitely going to come in handy for that. Also, I needed more vitamins. Um, guys, I have been completely just drained and depleted lately. And I know it, it's, it has to do with a lot of different things, but I know for a fact that I haven't been taking my vitamins. Um, and yes, I take multi-gummy vitamins. I, I, I can't, I hate swallowing pills. I can't stand it. So I can stand the chewable gummy um, type vitamins. So I picked up a pack for myself. Um, these were $6.76. I had a $4 off coupon, so I made them $2.76. Not bad. I actually take iron um, supplements because I am anemic. Um, and I also take B12 shots, but um, I haven't been to the doctor in quite a, a while, a couple months. And I need to get back to that because... I'm drained. Anyways, got that for myself. The kids, I got them gummies as well. I usually get the Flintstone gummies for them, but these were actually, you know, um, comparable to Flintstone gummies, I believe, and they were cheaper. So I got these instead for the kids. The yellow Mahatan, if I'm saying that right, Mahatan rice. We had those 50 cent off one coupon. Um, this is the 10 ounce bag. They're priced at $1.26. And with that 50% off um, coupon, it made them 76 cents, so I picked up five. Um, I actually love this rice. It's really, really yummy, and I make a few different type of recipes with those, so I got those as well. Then the other thing that I needed to pick up, well, I didn't need really to, but I came across this mug, and it's just the cutest thing. Hopefully, you guys can read it. It says, I want to be the person my dog thinks I am. Now, if you are a dog person, you totally get this. Even if you are not, you know someone that has a dog. And, I mean, when you walk into the house, you can have been gone outside for like less than 30 seconds. Your dog will greet you as if you have been gone all day long. I mean, it's just, hey, if you're a dog lover, you get it. But um, I, it just warmed my heart when I looked at this because when I think about it, like my baby Lola, she probably thinks that I'm the best thing since sliced cheese. And by the way, she likes sliced cheese. So it made me happy. Do I need another coffee mug? Absolutely not. But I'm going to try each day to be the person my dog thinks I am. There you have it. That was too adorable. Okay. 
I also picked some of this um, Perfect Edges um, Oreo up for um, Maddie. Now, if you guys don't know, haven't seen Maddie at all, Maddie got hair. She got hair for days. And she's actually completely natural now. Um, and when she went, started going back natural, her um, edges are really, really dry. And it's hard to get them to lay flat sometimes. So, anyways, I want to try this out and see how that would work. So, I got that. We needed more shower caps now. I usually get them at the Dollar Tree, but I just didn't have time to go to the Dollar Tree today. So, I picked them up. The girls are going to a sleepover tonight. So, they need to have shower caps. So, shower caps. And then I got a birthday gift for the sleepover. And actually, Maddie picked this out. This is pretty cute, though. And it's a little plastic purse. It's Barbie. That is cute. Maddie picked that out. So, got that as well. And then, of course, um, as always, we need to get our um, paper plate. So, that's pretty much it, guys. I spent a little bit more than I would have liked to. But it was some items that I actually needed to get replenished on and all that other good jazz. Um... I spent right about $46 at Walmart, um, and honestly, most of it was because of this $10 gift, this $7 stuff here, $4 mug. I didn't need that, but come on, that's just, that's too precious. And the kids' gummies were like 10 bucks, but anywho, I needed that stuff, so on and so forth. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to, sorry about that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe if you have not done so already, guys. And until next time, bye-bye.